All right, welcome. So what I want to talk to you about is what are positive and negative angles? Because what we're going to, when we get into this chapter, we're going to be dealing a lot about with positive and you know, negative angles. And we need to understand what exactly does the measurement, the direction, what are we talking about? So let's go back and let's take a look at actually two angles here. So let's say I'm going to try to do my best and create similar angles, right? Where now each of these angles, we're going to have a terminal and initial side. That is definitely your initial side. All right, and what I'm using them is in standard form. So there's my initial side, and here's my terminal side. Terminal. Sorry, I can't really write that well, but I want you guys to understand you're going to have a terminal and an initial side. Now, when we're looking in standard form, these two angles are in standard form, and you can see roughly, hopefully, they're kind of supposed to be the same, all right? Here's our initial side. That's where our angle is going to start. When we take our angle and we're going to rotate it, right, in this direction, creating this space, this is what we're going to call an angle in the positive direction, right? It can't have, just like you can't walk negative distance, you can walk in a negative direction, but you can't walk in negative distance. Any distance, you're, we talk about like absolute value from distance, right? Absolute value from zero. So this distance is going to be positive. So whenever we open up an angle and we refer to you moving in this direction, in the counterclockwise direction, we're going to call it a positive angle. However, if we remove in the opposite direction, which still even having the same initial and terminal side, we are now going to call the clockwise direction negative. So a lot of times you might see like negative, you know, 240 degrees. Well, how do you draw negative 240 degrees? Well, you still start at your initial side, but now you're going to go in the clockwise direction, will show negative 240 degrees, where um, this would be in the positive direction, which would say maybe 130 degrees, or I don't know. I mean, I'm just estimating the lengths there. But it's just important for you to understand that positive, we go in the counterclockwise direction, and negative, we're going to go in the clockwise direction. So that's positive and negative angles. Hope you enjoyed. Have any questions? Comment, subscribe below. Thanks. Right.